Hey everybody, it's Liz. Welcome back to my channel. So I'm here today to share a fun, a fun little uh, Valentine's Day project share. And uh, for my project, I use this paper collection called Awesome Valentine. It is an older uh, Michael's paper pad, you know, like the hot buys. It's from a few years ago, but I still have a ton of this paper and I do like it. It's got all, some gold foil and some really cute little images, you know, perfect for Valentine's Day. So I just thought I'd use this up. I'm trying to use up as much as I can because I'm trying not to buy anything for Valentine's Day. And so far I've done really, really good. So that's what I used. Now let me jump into the project. Um, and so, okay, so you know how like every holiday season we buy those cute little socks from like the Target Dollar Spot and Dollar Tree? Where I always buy them, I always buy them when I see them. So I thought this year I'd buy some for Valentine's Day and try to package them up in a much cuter way. So these I picked up from the Dollar Tree, of course, they're just a dollar, but I thought it'd be a really cute way to decorate them, you know, to create like a little sleeve for them. So that's basically all I did. It's like a little, um, almost like a, you know, like a coffee sleeve type thing. It does come off. So I started off by just cutting a piece of paper. It's a strip that measures seven and a half by three. And then what I did is I folded it over the socks and then I went ahead and used a little mini stapler to staple it together, you know, staple it closed. And of course you wanna make it so it's not so tight that this can easily, you know, slide on and off if you want to, because I do mean for these to be reusable. So this is a cute pair of socks and it's got a little belly band. So basically um, once I attached that strip, I went ahead and cut out another piece of pattern paper. And this time I used my corner punch. It's like a ticket um, stub one. And I just cut out the corners. I adhered it to the belly band itself. And then I went ahead and decorated using different uh, things that I had in my stash, like these hearts that I picked up from Walmart. They're those little die cut pieces that you find. And then I went ahead and fussy cut some images from the paper, such as this little letter, the typewriter, and then I um, also these up here. This is you are just my type. I thought that was really cute. I have some of the elements popped on foam for dimension. And then in the background, you see this uh, gold foiling. It's basically, I wish I would have kept the die in here, but um, I picked up from Allie. And it's just like a bunch of little lines, like zigzags and stuff. So I thought it would be just a cute little way to add another pop of color back there. So I cut that out and adhered it to the back before attaching my typewriter down. These are some cute little glasses that I've had in my stash from Hobby Lobby. They're like the little stickers. And then I just backed them onto a piece of cardstock that has like a little heart in the middle so I could have like heart eyes. And then I just finished it off with some sequins here and there. Here in the background of the, behind the heart, I have an arrow that I cut in half. I attached this part here and then the little arrow um, to the bottom to make it look like it's going through the heart really cute. I thought it was just a really fun way to decorate these little, um, these little, you know, socks. And I did take the packaging off, but I left these little plastic things inside. So that way it keeps the socks together. So I just thought that was a really cute way to dress these up. And so I made three and they're all pretty much, you know, the same. I just use different patterns, you know, pattern paper and different elements from the collection that I fussy cut, of course. This one is a whole, you know, the phone. So I've got a love letter in the back. Again, the sequins. Uh, this one says, you are phenomenal. And then I have these cute little lips. These are also from Hobby Lobby. They're like in the sticker section where the gems are located. And then the same thing with a little arrow. So really, really fun. And I was trying to, you know, come up with different ways to package these because I've packaged them in the past in like little bags, you know, little clear bags and things like that. But I thought adding like a little belly band, like a little sleeve would be really, really cute. I think this one's my favorite because I absolutely love this little truck. I think it's so cute. Again, it's an image that's fussy cut from the collection. I used foam. I have a cute little like um, acrylic arrow, a love letter in the back. Again, more sequins in the background. And this one says a truckload of awesome really really cute and they're so fun these were so easy to make because it just all it takes is one strip of paper again just you know you can use tape on the back if you want or some glue but i thought the staple was you know an easier way to do it and that way it can you know slide off really quick so these are so cute and again these are perfect for like year round because you know they always come up with different designs different little socks for like the holidays and seasons and things like that so just by changing the papers up a bit 
and using different types of embellishments, you can really decorate these all, you know, for every occasion. So I thought these, this was just really, really cute. I hope you like this idea as well. I know a, like, a lot of us like to give out these cute little socks, you know, in our happy mail and for our swaps and stuff. So I thought this would be a great way to package them up. So let me know what you think in the, uh, you know, comment section. Um, I always love to read your comments. I like to hear what you think. And uh, hopefully you guys will give these a go. I thought they were really fun and very cute and easy to put together. So thank you so much for watching. If you like my video, hit that like button. If you aren't subscribed, go ahead and subscribe. What are you waiting for? Love to have you. So thank you again for watching and I will be seeing you all real soon. Bye everyone.